Pleasant good morning. Pleasant good morning to God who's ahead of my life, my pastor, the members, and the viewers. My topic today is loss. Loss is the process of losing someone or something. Well, when I think about loss, I think about honestly, I think about games because we go through a whole bunch of losses through sports, and we just we we feel that all hope is gone. And you know, sometimes we're just not that good to get back our losses and turn them into wins. <clears throat> well, that's when we go wrong with the thought of loss. Loss is when we lose something, but it doesn't mean we cannot get it back. It doesn't mean we can't improve and it doesn't mean that we can't go anywhere in our life. Loss is something that, loss is something that had, that's a conscious, a conscious thought in our mind. That's somewhere in your mind where you have doubts and where you don't believe that, you know, you could be, you could be a better you or that, or that sometimes when you lose things, all hope is, all hope is on. Yeah. So when we think about loss, we think about, we can also think about people, people in our life or people, people that we lost in our life and like knowledge that we lost in our life and money that we lost in our life too. And, and it's all, it's all natural. It's all part of life. Well, I just encourage you to just, when you, when you lose these type, when you lose type of things, you just need to keep an open mind. You just need to keep an open mind and just realize we can't keep everything. We're going to have losses once in a while. We're going to get kicked to the ground once in a while. We're going to go through what we go through once in a while. We all cannot keep everything forever and at some point everything is at loss yeah so that's what that's another way to think about loss another way to think about loss is that it shouldn't it shouldn't bother you loss well loss it's natural to be to be bothered by loss but you should be you should be aiming for the level where you know you're gonna lose something when you not not intentionally lose something but you just you just know that you can't just you can't just continue you know everybody's not perfect there's gonna be something that goes down and something that go up once in a while we cannot we cannot you know we cannot win everything we cannot change everything and everything cannot be okay so loss is always a a factor in our life and we need to just learn that when sometimes when I go through loss, things don't ever things not don't ever, but things just don't seem as they was before. They seem very, you know, they seem very different, very broken, very distant from you. You know, like things just seem things seem like they will never be the same. Well, when it comes to when it comes to losing things and gaining new things. It will never be the same. We just need to learn that it will never be the same. But when we think about it, it will never be the same. We think about how what how we have right now isn't what we had before. And how, you know, how broken and sad and things are. And how, you know, thing, things will never be as great as they were. But when when you get new things and things that are currently occurring right now. And the achievements that you're getting right now. And the thing, the so, so many things that could possibly happen if you just open up your mind to the new things that you're getting. If you just, if you just think about, you think about what you can do, what you, what, what you have right now. When you think about, when you think like that, you, you're very optimistic. You turn to, you turn to one of those people that could make, make something out of nothing. You turn into one of those people that could be reliable on yourself and don't have to soak around and just like, give up you just turn into one of those people that are just relentless and just are working 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 and working to their goal and want to do the best for themselves and the people around them you turn into one of those people where 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 you could where anything could happen to them and like they could lose anything and they'll just move they keep keep rolling keep rolling keep rolling while i'm i'm personally i don't have any experience of of that type of like personality trait or like you know those type of people, but I'm I'm saying that if you turn it, if you turn into one of those type of, and you have one of the, one one of those type of mindsets, you could become invincible. You could become, you could become very, 
very motivational for the people around you. You could be very, you could be a positive person. You could, you you're probably already a positive person, but that will boost you all the way up. That will boost your confidence. That will boost your intelligence. That will boost everything. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. That will boost everything. So, in the end of the story, loss is a very good thing, but it, it, it hurts in a moment. But when you get past that feeling of of mistreatment and, you know, sadness and just brokenness, things become very more clear. I, I hope to see you on the next devotion on the 11th.